Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to the Scan Tool Network. Now in this video, we're gonna show you just a short demonstration of the Xtool D7 uh, and what systems it will cover when you are connecting this up to your Aston Martin DB9. Uh, we do get a, well, the reason for making this video is because we do get a lot of questions from DB9 owners asking which tool would be suitable for their needs. Um, and this is the tool that we generally recommend for them. It, uh, it covers a lot of systems within the DB9, uh, which I'll show you in a second. And uh, But there are fakes, there are clones on the market, they can damage your vehicle, so it's not worth going down that route. So we do recommend using the link in the description below. Okay, so first of all, what we're going to do is you would generally have this plugged into your vehicle the diagnostic port of the vehicle and we click onto the diagnostic section and the beauty of this Xtool D7 is that it covers a lot of other manufacturers as well okay um, so this is just the European menu uh, we can click onto the Asian menu and it shows you all of those the Americans China Australia even some electric vehicles but I wouldn't recommend this tool for that uh, so we're going to go to Europe we're going to go into Aston Martin and we're going to select manual selection to click yes to that and then we're going to select the db9 option which is down here so we'll go db9 okay system selection and then it opens up a new menu and it shows you which of these systems it will allow you to diagnose okay so the main systems that general DIYers would like to diagnose and reset um, are the engine systems so you've got across the top we've got different engine sections different engine control modules we've got transmission control modules on the next screen depending on which transmission is installed uh, we've got the ABS system also known as the BCM on this but it's the anti-lock braking system for ABS uh, brakes the airbag system and then we've got a lot more systems which are classed as lesser systems but still quite important um, but if you wanted to look at any of these diagnose reset any faults within these systems you've got the doors um, the damping the subwoofers media players electronic park and brakes uh, auxiliary ccms consoles things like that so there's a few different systems there that you could gain access to obviously it all depends on what is installed into your specific vehicle um, if you wanted to do the oil service reset on a db9 you can do that as well in just case of going well what you can do is i think you can go to uh, dashboard dim you will get a message an error message on this particular demonstration because we are not plugged into a vehicle but you can i think you can do it by that link there or you could just do it by coming completely out, going back to the home screen, going to special function, go to the oil reset, going to Europe, Aston Martin, and then going to manual selection, selecting the DB9, and then this way do it. But again, we'll get an error message because we're not plugged into the vehicle. Uh, but it's a fantastic tool. It covers a lot of systems on the Aston Martin and uh, obviously a lot of other manufacturers as well. I think most people who have a DB9 probably have another vehicle within their family setup. So it covers all of the other makes and models as well. But it's the Xtool D7. I'm gonna pop the link to this kit in the description below this video. It's a fantastic package. Thanks for watching and I hope this helps.